Interesting. Y'all need to do better. Ooh. Y'all. Wowzers. Mm. Y'all need to do better. How should we do She's saying she's going to take your spots? Wow. Them, them, oh, them. them? They, need to do, they need to be here. You hear that? You hear that? Listen, they're working you hard. You know, because, you know, a goosey can't what scoop it, so. Uh, yeah. exactly. Is a goosey guy here? A goosey can't scoop it, so. So you have Don't to, you have to, you have to uh. put in the work, all right? So. Yeah, cost of living is high. Yo, y'all didn't see, like, there was a lineup for the food bank in... Um, hey, yeah, I'm that's telling bad. you, they're actually using bush meat now in North America <laughs> in the goosey because it's wicked. <laughs> <laughs> they're actually using bush meat. And uh, we got Agusi. ourselves a click, bro. <laughs> that's great. What do you mean, bush? You mean moose? <laughs> moose? Oh, look, he's living, living. He's living lavish, bro. Oh, he's moose talking is about like, the top when of your head. Bush meat, that's actually, what he's talking about. about bush meat is. No, no, but what didn't... Is bush, bush meat like raccoon and, and, <laughs> and like <laughs> armadillo oh, and oh, all them yeah. things? Oh, no, no, she's from the upper class Nigeria. She don't do that. Uh, well, okay. Yeah, but yes. Armadillo Actually, and, uh, yeah, and, and... No, but what would be, what would be bush meat in Canada? Wouldn't it be moose? No clue. No. No, that's beaver, beaver, holy, not the beaver, damn. Oh no, they would. That's I don't think they. I don't think that's probably illegal Squirrel, in Canada. Raccoon. Yeah, I don't even know. Yeah, you get sued for that. Yeah, you probably get possum. sued. Possum. Oh, yeah, would you possum. eat a possum? No. 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 Full of Someone told. <laughs> you wonder why reason. COVID come back, no, sir, yeah, What's what's the wildest food you ever ate? Horse. Blood clad. <laughs> No, 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 no. She just said horse. Horse, yeah. Horse body? Which part of the horse? I'm not sure, but it was... Not me, you're not sure. Horse? No, no, no. Time out, time out. Not not sea biscuits. Pause, pause. (laughs) So you got a horse plate and didn't know what part of the horse? Yeah, yum? It was it was, uh-huh. it was in Japan, right? When I was living in Japan, the would, city I was living in. Nobody says anything incriminate and <laughs> <laughs> crazy. This, other whoa, cultures is other cultures. The city I was living in, the like horse meat is like one of their delicacies. So like obviously like <laughs> I tried to not eat it for the longest time because I'm like this is too weird. But I tried it one time and it was like grilled, so it was like little cuts of horse. Meat that you put like on the grill. It tastes kind of like beef. Yeah, it literally so, tastes like beef. Well, the frog legs take chicken rice. Not, back not, to my original not question. Not Bojack Harseman. <laughs> <laughs> You're a so, cool. so... Going back to my Not question. My little pony. Yeah, wow. <laughs> oh, no. My little pony, my little... <laughs> Oh, and that I, I and that know. ends the the podcast. <laughs> I don't know what part of the horse it was. But the question is, you didn't take your due diligence and ask what part of this horse is it? Like what? Remember, this is like, Japan, so be? I doubt you could actually ask anybody that. Yeah, and you don't have Google Translate. I figured it'd probably be like the leg. You see, you're saying you figure. I mean, like, do you know what part of the cow you eat? Huh? Do you know what part of the yeah, cow you ox eat? Ox tail is the ox. But tail. you're no. apart from the tail, like nobody like, knows. When you have ground beef. It's probably like everything on from the ground. That's what I said. From the ground. From the ground. Uh, <laughs> ground beef is everything. All parts of the cows mixed. But up, I'm sure. you know what I'm saying? Delicious. Like, you could have asked, like you know. But what am I gonna ask? like first? Like hey, you're the, learning the culture, what? correct? Me. Mm-hmm. It's, it's not. It's not like it's not like one of those. Stallion. Me. Which? It's not like one of those like oh God, scenarios. You just kind of have to like go with the flow. Yeah. How was your? And it was after? a very small piece. How was your belly you, after? It was fine. It was grilled, right? Yeah, so it was grilled. It's probably like literally an ass cheek or something, and they just grilled it up. <laughs> yeah, I saw something. You remember cow was rump roast, right? Is it not? Yeah, how was cow, who? Cow, cow has like rump rump, rump roast, right? That's it's, uh, um, elaborate. Uh, I don't know what that <laughs> you is. You don't know? <laughs> no, uh, and, and well, no, no comprende. Isn't that part, isn't that a we need to Google it. He's by himself in the middle. Right? Bro, 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 <laughs> no. What do you mean? Ro- what do you mean? Rump, rump roast. roast. Ass roast. Search. Search it up. <laughs> That's what oh, you call ro- rump. rump. His That's wife, what it's called. His white side came out. It's, it's called rump roast. <laughs> his, Look, read it. It's my, it up. my lovely is a rump yes. roast. No, but, man, search it up. I'm not talking. My lovely lady <laughs> hump. Is that what you mean? Rump. <laughs> rump. No, yeah. it is called rump roast. And it's which part of the cow? The body. The bum. Hold on. Let me get there, guys. We not name the bodies. We name the teal though. <laughs> Spice <laughs> sure, well, I'm sure. I'm sure you eating it. Keep digging. Keep digging. I'm sure you. I seen a, I seen a video where the, 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 the uh, Rasta man was saying, "Yo, how you eating the?" Because in Jamaica there's a yam called pum pum yam. Really? Yeah, there's a the yam called pum pum yam. Oh god. And the Rasta man was like, 
Med ett jam, ett oh, pom pom jam. Så so, rump roast is a cut of beef from the top of the the top of top of the back end of a cow. Yes. So uh, the body. See, am I crazy? So that's like a delicacy. It's not a delicacy, <laughs> but once again, right? <laughs> You're eating, uh, people that eat that same way you can eat a horse's ass. <laughs> <laughs> Without even knowing it. Without even, <laughs> you don't even know, right? So I figured it's just it'd just be like uh I feel like it'd just be like a muscular like, part of the, the and thing. Come on now, an ass is a big muscle, right? So, yeah. <laughs> you're telling me, hey, so, it's true. So yeah, so girls, you yeah, make, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm rump, rump, rump. <laughs> some, some of you ladies need to eat. <laughs> some of you ladies need to eat more rump roast, cause boy. No, that's what the ladies are talking about. I mean, so I, I mean, eat more rump roast. I mean, like uh-huh. speaking of things you eat, like y'all ever had strongbuck? Strongbuck. Do y'all know what in? Yeah, do y'all know what's in strongbuck? Mm-mm. Cause it's always like hold up a bunch of foolishness that they put in there and like supposed Irish to like mash and oats and stuff like that of that nature, correct? Yeah. Do you believe in those remedies and shit? I'm not gonna lie, it's been carrying me thus far, so I'm not turning. For real? <laughs> I'm... Get the oats, get the sub agent, get the nut, <laughs> get rum, the nut men. I mean, blend you're... it up and turn it on your head. You're a strong man, man. It's strong man, man. Come on. You drink that thing religiously? Not religiously. Uh, but when the time comes, does like, it help? Honestly, honestly it tastes, to me, it tastes good. Does it help? Um, Not really. It, it it does to a degree, but when you're honey, you're honey. So, like, there's right. no, there's no, oh, if, it, if it's going to turn up if I drink this. It's going to turn up when you see crutches anyways. You say, so, does, it, does it boost to get multiple rounds? Yeah, does it make you like? I think I think I squeeze the extra round or two when drinking not it. An extra round <laughs> or two. Well, yeah. in it, you just have to strut. Because <laughs> because because str- <laughs> yeah, on crazy. the table is just like what well, nah, 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 nah. No, because I I Sipping like I lo- oh, Nah, that's crazy. God, no, it's because I. It up and just I <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> okay, that's crazy. let's go. I I like sex, so I can go for a while. So that's all. Watch out. Speaking, um, speaking of sex Jamaican, right? Speaking of sex Would y'all do uh, Be sperm donors How many zeros Wow Do people get You're paid For scum. donating sperm Yes I know yes. This, I know in the states I don't know about here though Yeah I'm pretty sure yes oh, Let me yeah. google it oh, I don't know about here yes. I mean this is This is a yes. question Cause for like uh, What's her name The brat She was on Um I don't know what interview or where she did said it. She was like, she got a sperm from a white man because the one black the one sperm. black guy looked like a horse. Oh, no, like no, Jiminy like Jimmy Cricket. the Cricket. Jimmy the Cricket, correct. Yeah, wow. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. What is, is what it? What does it look like? Donors earn a hundred for each donation. Seventy dollars at the time of donation. Thirty when the sample is released. Healthy men what do you able. Mean? Healthy men are able are able to earn up to fifteen hundred a month. Wait, so you, wait, like the U.S. <laughs> Canada in Canada. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hold oh, up. You get paid a hundred dollars to masturbate. <laughs> yeah, so. <laughs> That's crazy. But then, but then again, you, you want to ask yourself: exactly. well, Do you want to like give away your seed like that, just like that? Five Not knowing like who, man, what do we say? who might have your seed in the future, like not knowing, might it's not, not like, knowing like. I mean, like it's it's part of the Trinidadian culture. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you thought I was gonna say Jamaican? No, no, I'm showing somebody else yeah, under the culture. Perfect, I'm joking, Trinidadian people don't come yeah, for me. Yeah, but at least with that, like <laughs> it's still bad. But at least with that, you know who the who oh, the person is. In the business, what the fuck? Sorry, I mean a hundred dollars. Keep so going, apparently, right? One, two, where's the strong part? Wait, hold on, hold on. <laughs> so the highest, $100? so the highest paid from what I'm seeing, like donating one two times per week, donors can earn an average of 40 k in six months. Yeah, man. But once again, you have and we're back. See that take two? That's acting for the eighth time. <laughs> <laughs> How much time to go be back? Like what? We want to get paid for yeah. three hours, right? I don't know yeah. if we can. Y'all seen? Y'all seen the? Y'all heard this clip? What bills you expect a man to pay when you first start dating? Uh, when you first start dating? Mm-hmm. Nine. Like three months. 
Three months in, probably like rent. Like, rent. Turn it off, yeah. I don't want to hear it. In LA? Wait, no. let me hear the rent. Your rent is how much? It's like 3800 So I got to pay 4000 mm. You don't have to, but like, I expect a man to want to help. Like, I'm not like, hey, babe, like, I need you to pay all my rent up six months. Like, I expect you to be like, oh, here's like a couple grand on your rent. Or if you want to be nice, like, here's your rent. Here's your rent money. Or... Even if you don't want to pay the rent, be like, oh, here's some extra money for your car note or, or groceries or whatever. Like, I expect the man to do. Like, I don't really expect. That is the most contradicting sentence I've ever heard. My question for y'all is, after, because after the podcast we put, we um dropped last week, Drew asked a good question where it's like, is a man broke if he doesn't want to go 50-50? And a lot of people, it's like... I'm wondering, we have a lady on the podcast. Thank you for coming back. You're, <laughs> you're here from the lockdown days. Yep. Lockdown days. You're with from us the shooting in the days. gym. <laughs> <laughs> like, because I'm, I'm starting to wonder if women are like, not that you represent all women, of course, but yeah. I'm starting to wonder, and, and uh, how, are these women losing it? Yes. I feel yeah. like. A lot of it. Like, not a little bit, like a lot of it. <laughs> so. Everyone's losing it. So she said she expects her man to pay her rent in three months. I mean, not not the full rent, you know. You could throw a couple thousands, or pay the car note. Yeah, or pay no, the car note. That's crazy. Grosses. To me, that's crazy. Like, that's it. I don't, I don't. You definitely, I definitely do not expect like three months of knowing somebody and you're expecting them to like pay something towards your rent. Like, why? Like, wh- just to show that you know he because cares and he loves. yeah, because apparently women aren't adults too. Because yeah, of course. Like for some she reason, said her rent is thirty eight hundred. In yeah, LA. girl, you need to buy a house. Thirty eight hundred for rent. Yeah, she, I think they're in LA. In America, yeah, that's, that's America. That's crazy, but yeah, no, I think that's ridiculous. That's absolutely ridiculous to be expecting a man to like finance your lifestyle of three months of knowing him. Mm. That's ridiculous. So let me ask you this though: Do you expect certain monetarily things done for you by the person who's pursuing you, or with you? Like, are we saying, are we dating? Like, are, like, at what stages are we talking here? Official. official. Like, we're official. Official like, might be getting engaged soon. Then, well, yeah, I feel like stuff like paying for dates, for sure. Um, well, Moxie's bill covered. Let's go. Oh, t- Moxie's. And we're back. Oh, Technical man. difficulties. We're back. You gotta Com- have some kind of... Hey, Artes, you're back in the building. What's wow, up? Wow, Pulse Production Pulse. is crazy. Yeah, you I, I, just popped out of nowhere. I flashed, I flashed <laughs> up here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I did a Houdini trick and I'm here. That's crazy. I'm going to do a Houdini trick, like, trick like one of those bad budget African films. And <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> the bad Not the bad films, bunny yeah. African <laughs> films. Bad Before we get into our new conversation, just to finish off what you were saying about, like, um, basically what a man coming into your life would pay for or whatever. <laughs> your question is funny um no but i because you were asking like if we were together but like not married but like we were just official mm. i was just saying i would not expect the man i'm not expecting the man to like if we're going based off your clip i'm not expecting the man to like pay for my rent or like pay for my car payments or pay for a bill like i'm not expecting that from a guy maybe because me myself I'm a pretty independent person. Like, I already do that oh, the on women, my own. Independent. So I'm not expecting that from a, a man that's not my husband. If, mm. we're, we're, if we're married, then that's a different case. Obviously, our finances will be um, combined. But before then, I'm not expecting that. Like, all I expect for you is to, okay, take me out. Maybe we'll go out on dates. A little gift here and there. Maybe, like, both of us trips but that's, I feel like that's a two way thing that are you guys combining bank accounts before marriage after maybe one but I don't think all the bank accounts should be combined mm. question, I think one should be question to that is that question in refer- reference to are you see living with you or are you guys uh, separate not the bank account question just like, the fact that if we're just stuff. dating or if we're yeah. just official yeah. I personally wouldn't live with my mom before we're married really no okay. interesting why well, that's like yeah you're sure is that, you a, is, is, is that a Brock I don't feel thing? like you need to live with him to know 
You sure about that? Mm. I feel like you don't need to live with him to know. Mm. Dutty I, draws I, all I over the place like, afterwards. Like, like <laughs> because <laughs> there should be a trial period, though. I personally, personally, I don't, I don't, I don't agree. And this might just be like my faith thing. I don't want to live with you before we're married. Oh, okay. That's fair. Oh, is that because because of your faith thing? Mm-hmm. Uh, That's fair. Is that? Uh, That's fair. I'm cool with that. Religion, you know. Religion? Are, are you very religious? I would say my faith is very important to me. Yes. Okay. Yeah. It's more of a principle thing. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I can agree with that. Okay. I don't. Yeah, that's fair. Mm-hmm. That's that's respectfully fair. So, you can ask this question yes or no if you want to. Do you also not believe in like sex before marriage, and all that stuff? It's so inna. It's yeah, so inna. I it's know. Why is he so fast? Yeah, it's so I mean, fast like, in the girl business. I know. Why is he fast in my business, bro? Inna. Nah, I want to say you can answer. Yes you're or no. very inna. You're very inna. Is it? Yeah. That, that was very inna. Nah, I said choose answer. Yes if you're gonna no. talk, you're smack talking. Do you the do, do you uh, believe in believe in your uh, religion? Uh, obviously. Are you, are you having sex before marriage? I am. Which, I'm not saying it's right, but I am. <laughs> why yeah, Why yeah, are I'm you? Why, why shouldn't, <laughs> you, <laughs> why shouldn't you stop? <laughs> huh? Don't you think you should stop, sir? Yeah, of course. Watch out. Mm. <laughs> denying it. Oh, God. You see me denying it? Huh? I'm not denying it. Okay. Just because you don't deny it, don't make the sin any better. No, it doesn't make the sin Ooh. any better. I know that for a fact. Frolic and fornication, big mm-hmm. one. Frolic. Sorry, love. <laughs> Your man, of course. <laughs> just yeah, yeah. So all, all <laughs> I like saying, like you know, just, you know I don't know, whatever. That video, all I can say to you about that is, yeah, that's not happening for me. In three months, I'm paying your rent. Yeah, that's not right, happening. Like so, oh, so you missed it. So basically, the the girl said like, within three months, um, you should be paying the bill. Basically, who? A girl, a shorty, a woman, a rent, queen. Thirty eight hundred dollars. Some video he played. Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, the women, the women these, God yeah, w- the women these days are lost, and they're <laughs> looking for an opportunity to revert back into the the princess treatment that their absentee father wasn't there to give them. Wow, I like how you went deep. In oh, that say, actually, what I, you I, say father? You wait, wait, father, wait, wait. Father they're father lost because they're looking for security. Is that what you, is that what you're essentially saying? Yeah. I mean, if we're adults, we're, what do you mean looking for security? Why is that? Why is a man? Why is a man providing your security? But traditionally, if we're if you want to talk about tra- traditionally, I don't want to talk about tradition. Okay, so do you want a? <laughs> well, tradi- do you wait, framework. Hold on. So question: Do you want a traditional woman? No. Do you want a traditional woman? No, no. Do you want a traditional woman? Drew? I don't care, but most likely no. You know he's gonna be on Scrub, the fence. Scrub, Scrub. I said I don't yeah, care, but most saying. likely he, no. He could have said no. Or yes. What, what is a traditional woman? What's, what's the and that's that's what Stay I said. Home, cooking clean, right? A traditional woman mainly is like the woman that ma- her home. main priority would probably be like to take care of the home, take, take care, care of the kids, you, not take saying, care of the kids, take care of you. Care of you not saying you, that she be can't there, be your support. Back yeah, home, not to say she can't. Not that? to say mm-hmm. she won't like have her own, yeah, but that's like her primary thing to be like to literally be the man's helpmate. But that's your definition. That's yes. why I said no, no, no. But that is that is the so then yeah, you said no to that. Yeah, you said no to that. Do I want the traditional woman? No. No, I would, so I would probably get that woman. done. So what isn't a traditional woman? No, no. What you asking me? What I want? Contributes to the bills. Uh, that, that no, no, no. So what are you asking me? What so I so want? You don't want a traditional woman. No. So what isn't a traditional woman? Then? What isn't? That I, I, that's just a broad statement. I can't right. just answer Thank what you. isn't. Good answer. What, what's a good answer? What he just said. Okay, yeah, so let's talk, then, then let's. If you're asking me, if you're asking me, if you're asking me what I, if you're asking me, if you're asking me what I want, I can tell you what I want. That's not traditional. That's no. I want a dynamic that is conducive for the the family that I'm trying to build. I don't need a frame. Your dictionary fell out. Hold on. What kind of family are you trying to build? What kind of family What kind of family you trying to build? Uh, what type of family I'm trying to build? Yeah. A very solid one. A very um, I'm trying to break generational curses. Okay. So I want it to be a family dynamic where it's not 
based on the nuclear family where it's a boy and a girl and the family and the, the dog and the picket fence. I don't know. Maybe five years we're living in Canada. Maybe six years we're living in Cuba. It's a dynamic where I'm providing enough and we're providing enough where I can afford the lifestyle that my ki- that I didn't I wasn't able to have. Um, nuclear family that, meaning it, you don't want like a uh, husband, wife, kid situation? That's no, no, no. A nuclear nuclear family. family meaning that nuclear family is like um, cookie cutter. Cookie no, cutter. Basically, soul, like soul. husband and wife, a boy and girl. You're raising them, you're part of the PTA meeting. You live in the suburbs. You're going to nine to five. You're coming home. But that, but that still doesn't mean you can't have a traditional woman, though. That's, but, that's, but that's, I'm oh, saying, he asked me what type of life serious. I want. Right. So I'm just answering that question. Let's but say, what you want you, still involves having a traditional woman. No. You're going to get there. Yes, no. Is. Listen, he no, wants wait, his wait, wait, own wait. unique dynamic, you know. What you're thinking about his, is like... His a- daughter could want... His daughter could be a 14-year-old who likes trains. Call back. Pause. <laughs> why, why are you... He, Call girl, back. speak y'all a funny it. joke, y'all, bro. Y'all, like, yeah, what the hell? That's what I'm saying, you know. <laughs> right? And if his daughter wants... I'm joking. I'm just saying. I know, but your joke got left, bro. Like, what y'all, the hell? Anyway, okay. okay. And what is the traditional woman to you? The one that just hmm? stays home and cooks? Is that what it, is that what it is? No, so a traditional woman is someone, like she said, like someone who's, uh, you could add that to it, stays home, cooks, take care of the family, take care of, the, take care of you, makes my lunch, right, iron so my clothes. That's a part so of it. your girl right now. Hmm? Your girl right now, she's not traditional? If my girl's traditional? Yeah. No. She's not, what makes her not traditional? She do, I'm not she married to her. I can't, I can't. For, 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 no. Pause, Tristan, no, pause. <laughs> you're still in a relationship. Doesn't, just because you're not married doesn't mean... Mm-hmm. A marriage is just a relationship, just a piece of paper. You know what I mean? You just don't. You know, no, but like, how are how are you going to say the traditional woman when I'm not married? I can't say what she does. Now we're not living traits. together. She does have traditional traits. You still guys are still together. You guys still traditional act like traits. A couple, but you act like no, a no traditional you traits. Couple. So, you know, when you're with a girl and you're with her, it's your girl. You're like, yo, you know, I can be with this girl for like, I can see myself with this girl because she has such and such and such. I like traditional traits. Whatever it is, like like what? Like, your girl doesn't have that. Tradition. What well, list some traditional traits, and I'll say yes if she does. Because mm-hmm. I, uh, I don't. I'm not looking for that, so I don't know how to. All I know is cook, clean, take care of the kids. Um, Want to be a wife, trophy wife, PTA meetings, those sort of stuff. You don't. So right now you don't consider her your wife. Hmm? Right now you don't consider her your wife. Don't divert. Uh, I'm not diverting. <laughs> right don't now, divert. No, I'm not diverting. Right now you don't consider your wife. Don't divert. <laughs> Where I, I actually need to list okay, some she stuff. Huh? She cooks for you. She tries, but no. She tries, so she, yeah, she tries. You. She tries, yes. Just because just it's not that great doesn't mean she. Yeah, do she. It. Yeah, you're you're okay. correct. Yes. Uh, she asks how your day is. She supports you. That's not. Tra- I don't think that's traditional. It but okay, yes. Yes. Yeah. It's your backbone, right? Yeah, but that's not ha- nothing to do no, with there's traditional. A lot of traditional things a girl can bring to the table. Mm-hmm. It's not just cook, cleaning thing. What else is there? So I would love to know what else is there. Um. You do stuff for her, like you know you. you See plan, the thing? You, no, no, you plan stuff for her. See or, the thing is, a lot of men want these. Oh, I want this traditional woman, traditional this, and but we don't even know. What they don't even know what it is. Like, we don't even know. They don't even know what it is. We all remix it. That's they all remixes. We all remix girl, our that's old not, girl, does, does she talk to multiple guys at once? Are you? That has nothing to do with traditional. 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 Huh? That, that is traditional. That, no, one, no, it's not. It is. How, How is it traditional? Is Jada a traditional wife? Huh? Is Jada a traditional wife to work? She's not a wife in general. That's, uh, that's not traditional. She's not a wife in general. Not traditional. No, but no, it doesn't matter like, if it's traditional or not. Oh, She's just not a wife. Oh, some people. She's like, for the corner. Some okay. Some couples like Pandakana. Pandakana. No, what's this thing? Some couples do. They do um, swinging. 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 That's swinging. not traditional. Yeah. Mm-hmm. To them, it is. No, that's not that's traditional. It's, it's not, not tra- but to know, them. No, it's not. no, no, but you can't. They know it's, they know it's no not to traditional. Them. They uh, they consider themselves progressive people. Yeah, that's progressive. So they consider themselves progressive into, people. In, into swinging is like no so you no but I'm saying like a lot of men that. a lot of men like talking about you want this traditional this traditional that but y'all y'all don't know how to describe you're not describing it to me describing but a lot of a lot of I think a lot of like traditional traits um de- depends on a lot of like cultural cultural stuff, too and it also depends on a lot of like religious stuff like that's so true. that's true so I think that's where a lot of tradition traditional traits come from like for example when I said I don't want to live with my man before marriage. That's, fair. that's that's traditional. a traditional. Yeah, you know, mm-hmm. that's a traditional trait. Uh, sex, no sex before marriage is technically it's technically traditional. traditional, but it's also like uh, religious. But it's it could be considered traditional. Yeah, it could be. You know? it's both. Yeah, it's, it's both. intertwined. So like those are like some traditional traits. 
I mean, personally for me, I feel like to in my core, in my core, I'm I'm pretty traditional, but I also have like a lot, but I'm also like Progressive. I feel like I'm high, like I'm a hybrid, like in certain. certain I thought you were cases. gonna say like high when, maintenance. I think I don't think, think I'm high maintenance. I think I'm like hybrid, like mm, when, yeah. when it comes to certain things, like That's especially cool. like career wise. I think what you guys get confused is you guys think traditional housewives are a woman that stay locked in and and and, and do nothing, just devote their time to house and cooking, cleaning. I think that's what you guys think. Well, yeah. Drew has the computer in front of him. I'm sure he'll be Googling what traditional woman is in the meantime. Let's do that right now. Wait, no, that's what you think. You no, said no, yes. No. He, he does. Mm-hmm. Well, you guys are probably thinking, like, no, nah, I want my girl I want my girl to have a little bit more freedom, which is fine. Right? But that does not mean... Which that, is fine. Well... No, a little bit of freedom. Obviously, you don't want to lock her in anything all day. And it's like... <laughs> a little bit. Just a tiny. I mean? Just a little smidge. I think for you guys, that's what you guys really mean. Mm-hmm. But and they, I still think you guys still want a traditional woman. And I think a tra- and a traditional woman will also be like the man's the breadwinner of the house. I know you don't want you don't want that. You want to go fifty fifty, right? So <laughs> I'm the type of person. Once again, I'll be seventy thirty. Really, I'll be the breadwinner for the most part. Mm-hmm. But you have to from, contribute something. You, thank you. Right. Come on now. When shit really goes left, and I need you to be there. Yeah. Be there, but like eighty percent of the time, shit. That's I'm not traditional, traditional, bro. Huh? That's not traditional. That no. is that is traditional. You guys are crazy, man. Y'all don't even know traditional what, is a hundred zero. Traditional is a hundred zero. There's no oh, there's no contribution. Oh, you guys don't even know untraditional. Traditional is not no no seventy oh, thirty. There's it's a hundred zero. That's not traditional. It's a hundred zero. It's high dear. Here's your sandwich. No, it could be it could be traditional because if the thirty is like okay, she's just gonna pay for groceries or something. That's not? still you're, not traditional. It can be. No, yes, can. it is. Do you see what Steve Harvey said? Steve Harvey said, know, um, "That is uh, traditional." What, traditional. Huh? What is that, man? But but you're saying the same thing he's saying though. What? No, but that. Why, is, why does a woman have to bring anything to the table? Facts. But that is yeah, that is traditional because traditional a tradition in a traditional sense the man will take care of the heavy. They'll do the heavy lifting. Not the heavy. All. Because remember, yeah, women about. weren't in the workforce. What did you just say? All oh, women have to met. Um, women were in the workforce. No, uh, you'd want a woman to do all the work or something like that, or not bring anything to the table. Oh no, Steve Harvey said, um, "Why would y'all want? What, what's wrong with these men these days? Why? Why y'all want? Um, uh, why y'all woman? asking? What's what, what a woman can bring to the yeah. table? I'll and you, sure. you've asked that question before. What? 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 Do, what yeah, because a woman should bring something to the table. So, uh, so, traditional wife brings something to the table. So that's not that's not <laughs> traditional, sir. That is traditional. A traditional wife brings something to the really table. Do what? Is, what do you see the definition of traditional? Ah, uh, the word refers to traditional woman. Yep, yep. Uh, a woman associated with uh, traditional gender roles, norms, and values that have been assigned to her by her society since. Time immoral. A traditional woman's role in society is directed towards homemaking, caregiving to her children, and raising them to be upstanding members of society. Yeah, it's all about the home, the role they play. Huh? You don't want that? But that's the a sign like okay you're stuck here you're the, in the home Girl, you're you're the, my food is here, make sure my, my food is here. You know what? No, I do not want. We all that. have roles to play in life. Yo, you're, 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 he's he's, hop, yo, he's hopscotching. Hmm? I know no. hopscotching. We all have roles to play. What are you talking right now, about? He's digging. Huh? Yeah. There's, some that, <laughs> right there's some things that your wife can't teach your kid, and something you can teach your kid. Like what? There's a lot of things, bro. I just want an example. You know what I mean? How to pay this? How to how to pour? How to this? How to? I agree that. I agree that. I agree that. And 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 maybe there's some things that. My we wife won't. can teach my daughter that I can't teach her. That's true. One hundred percent. You need you need you need balance. balance. Woman, uh, what's it called? Woman Masculine energy traits. and feminine energy. So you're telling me all that you don't want a traditional woman. Once it's again, still, my woman can have traditional traits mm-hmm. that I would like, but not a traditional. You know, role. role. Alright, let's let's. Nice. All right. <laughs> all right. I know, I know. It's gonna get real. What do you all right, think? All right, all right. Let's let's, 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 let's so move on real quick. But let me break it down in basketball terms so oh people God, can understand please. it. He doesn't right. even hope you know. No, 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 wait. Let me break <laughs> break it down. I'm the best superhero. Let me break it down. Let me break it down in basketball terms. Okay. All right. James Harden is James Harden a point guard? No. But they still he has some paper. traits, some point guard traits, right? Yep. Is Luca a point guard? No, not really. But he has a lot of point guard traits. So Steph you, Curry. So you want a Steph woman Curry? Is Steph Curry a point guard? Yes. No. So you want a yeah. woman that's not a wife but has some wife traits? Yes. 
Thank you. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. Right, nah, he'll hug that. That's, that's fine. <laughs> 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 you know, he'll hug that. He'll hug that. Yeah, yeah. So hug so that. Your girl's not a wife. Huh? Your girl's not a wife. You just said. See, he keeps. He's trying to like. Yo, your new name. Your new name is Doctor Strange. Yo, he's just trying to. No, no, no. Every possibility. Every possibility. He's trying to. You cannot trick me. You're just dodging the question. I'm not dodging. You literally. You said you want a wife. Okay, you want you literally said you want a wife, wife, wife with some white wife treats. No, that's what he said, right? What did you do? He said you want a woman that's not a wife. No, no, no. He said you want a wife with some wife treats. I said yes. Is that what he said? He said a woman with wife treats. Yes, exactly. You want a woman with wife treats. Correct. I heard wife with wife treats. Not a wife, but has some wife treats. Correct. Yes. That's not a wife, but has some wife treats. Correct. Well, she's gonna be my wife with wife treats. You have a problem That's with a that? good chess mm-hmm. move. That's not a good chess move. Get that nigga right. You have a problem with that? <laughs> Get you that nigga right. Yeah, you're confused, man. I'm strapped I'm, in. <laughs> no, I'm not confused. I'm not confused. Confused, man. No, I'm not confused. I just, I just feel like it. Realistically, it just depends on you and what you want out of your relationship. And all in beyond. I think, I think ultimately, I think ultimately, and again, it comes down to culture and thing because definitely, I, I do see that. A lot of African guys, they tend to lean more towards that that traditional yeah. stuff and like wanting and wanting that. And then I, I find with a lot of Caribbean guys, they kind of like it's like whatever, whatever. Flexible, They'll right? just take whatever, whatever. So I feel like I feel that also plays a role into why maybe more African guys get married. And I think that's also plays a role into why maybe a lot of Caribbean women are leaning more towards African guys, in my opinion. <laughs> you, <laughs> why? Because they want to be wifey We're not number gonna three? Get into in my that. opinion, We're not going to get into that. We're not going to get into that. Go ahead. Keep going, though. No, I'm not going to get into that. Go. No, no. Say what you want to say. Say what you have to say. Say, say what you have to say. I think, I think Drew is going to say that, sure, they get married, but like... At the end of the day, like... You uh, could they're be, not happy? You could be wifey number two and family number there? three. That that's nah, also a can't, thing can't as well. Hello, he's mad. Do I? <laughs> any, like, come any, on, like, any, any, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Again, can cheat, but you can't really camp with anybody. But what? No, no, I'm not saying cheating. Cheating is one thing, but like the stories I see online, and again, for anyone out there listening, we're not trying to condemn a whole culture of people. Yeah, it's, whatever it's, 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 it's just like anecdotal learning. evidence. When they talk about cheating. Jamaican man or a Caribbean man, they'll cheat. They have a woman on the side. They have a white woman for the passport or something. <laughs> <laughs> for the credits. For the, for the green card or something, right? Yeah, I'm on. But when it comes to like a Ghanaian or a Nigerian, they'll have a whole family. Like married two time, three time. A whole family that you don't even know about. Jamaican, I, I've Actually, never no, heard a Jamaican man doing. They'll know about it, yes, but they'll I, tell I've you heard, heard that, that I have a family. I've heard, I've heard that. Am I lying? What Jamaican man? No, not Jamaican man. Like, but uh, maybe Ghanaian man. They have a whole family. They have a family in Ghana, family in U.S., and a family in Canada. That's not true. But, all right. You, Probably like some kind of next African. Maybe, maybe. You mean the next African? African? Not, 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 <laughs> not you showing only one. Not you showing on the Sierra Leone. Maybe like a fraudster African, you know what I mean? A fraud. But the funny yeah, thing is, you said true. next and fraud, but after those words no, came African. It's very, it's very rare. <laughs> and you know what, though? The dude will What's still be committed to his family. He's just is cheating. It? Yeah, he'll, com- he'll, be, he'll be committed yeah, to all three families. One family. Mm. Mm. I mean, it's all one, one right? It's all <laughs> one family. No, all United Nations. Uh, we're, not, we're not that dumb to have like three of them. Like, all, what do you think he has to scam? Because he has to provide for three families. Money for nah, Come on. Big stories you hear like that. He has oh. to have three identities, of course. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's some, but it's very rare to do that. It's not true. I wouldn't say it's rare. From the, from the, the from the. Mm. is rare. And that's why, and that's why y'all be driving Sometimes the women. Not that's high. why y'all be driving the women them crazy. You, you Ghanaian men. No, you don't. Yeah, you, you do. do. Yeah, you guys do. Oh, we ju- there's a difference between the Ghani- you driving them crazy and Ghani we women. Them Ghanaian crazy. women always talk about it. That's why they love Jamaican, because you know Jamaicans are technical Ghanaians, right? Mm-hmm. But we're like, we're like, when it comes to those 
kind of foolishness we're diet with it we're not gonna have a whole family with, with on you or something we might have a one gal but not ten gal in a bungle <laughs> <laughs> one, from Rima, one, one from Rima one from Rima one from Jungle come on you know we're not gonna have a whole family I don't know about that man but that's why y'all be driving y'all be driving these women crazy Listen, bro man, like I told you guys when I was younger I had a Jamaican friend I went to his house mm. dad is married everything pulls me to the side and, and his son he's like see them girls get him yeah, yeah. The, and they come like Cutty King or whatever you yeah. call him. You know what I mean? Mm. So he's telling him to fling cocky. That's all he's yeah, telling him to do. Funny. That's a, at what? the end of the day, yeah, both, dad, we both like parties need to do better. All, all the other, yes. But what? But, both but, but why did you say? What do you? Why do you think that? Um, like a lot of Caribbean men are not getting married, or I don't think there's. Frolic. I don't think there's just the. I don't think it's just really been a part of like the culture type of thing like that. Uh, I don't know about that one. I could see that. I don't. You know, I don't know if you, if you want to get deep, I could I could tell you why. It's because of slavery. Of course, exactly. <laughs> of course. Oh, no, you I laugh, but it's true. I, I know huh? you're gonna <laughs> use that excuse. No, remember, like we were I, because you guys sold us on the boats. Um, <laughs> like from, oh my God. fingers no, because you guys we sold us. We were organizing. We were the main organizer. <laughs> 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 well, you organized though. So, no, so Europeans. So yeah, because of, because of that, like <laughs> our ancestors, unfortunately, we didn't know. <laughs> Our ancestors, unfortunately, they weren't allowed to get married because yeah. of the, the the colonizers, right? Mm -hmm. So if they used to get married when they used to be on the plantation, they used to separate the man and the woman and then beat and them and embarrass them and um, we we'll call it buck, buck them buck or whatever. Uh, um, so because of that, mm -hmm. like if generations and generations, you're ingraining in us, don't get married, don't get married. And then once you get our freedom and the system is not there where we have that, that mentality where we have to start family and one family and do that, it's it, so it's still are, so y'all are broken. Generational curses, bro. So the fu the funny thing so is a lot of generational curses so still exist, but they're they're being broken though. Huh? They're being Ge broken. Generational mm -hmm. curses still exist, bro. Yeah, don't blame no generational curse. You're aware of it now, so now you can do something about it. Yeah, and, and then yes. they're getting married, and mm -hmm. that's why I'm. Tristan is gonna break generational curse with his black queen. He's gonna break break generational curse with his black queen, and I'm gonna be break, breaking um generational curses. Mm -hmm. That's all we aim to do with yeah. your black queen. Black, black of the black from straight from Nigeria. Okay, you get man. me. So is this so like your woman's Nigerian? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't do Jamaican. Oh, so you're, her. you're so sick. You hear this? He's so you're sick. This, right? <laughs> but yeah but I'm like like we have to break uh -huh. generational curses at the end of the day like even like stuff that we learn from like our parents like I'm I'm pretty sure we're proud of our parents and what they had to do for us mm -hmm. but a lot of stuff that we um, were raised on were kind of I will right, right as they know it at the time but wrong when we look back at it I will say though I do see a lot more um Black men in general, whether Caribbean or African, are more open to the idea of like getting married and like are actually like trying to lean toward that. I'm seeing it in my you, circle. You know what? I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna nip this in the bud. Even our We're not gonna. I have to agree with you, but I have to Different. put a statement on it. I understand that you're saying that you see it, but it's it's been in men's head most of the time to want to settle down. Okay. The question is, who is serious about us for us to settle down with? Do that mean? is the problem. It's never about the settling down. Because I, just like how you talk to you in your circle, I have a lot of black men that I've talked to that want to, even young guys that I know, like in their early 20s, they're like, yo, I want to settle down. I actually want to meet that one person. But the way... Like, you know, the generational curses, the, the cycle that they've seen, what's, you know, I'm being right. displayed on social media, what they, 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 no, but what I'm saying is from curse. what they see and what they've experienced, especially with close people around them, rather be family members, their friends and all that stuff, it, it's hard for them to be like, I want this marriage because like, just for certain ladies, like they want the marriage, but they kind of standoffish too because it's like they want to put their all in a man but because of what they've dealt with and what they've gone through with different men they're kind of on the hopscotch you're like I want to get married but I don't want to deal with this but you didn't say anything that I didn't say hmm? you just agreed with me no but you said that men now 
I'm saying I'm seeing to. a I'm seeing it a lot now. I'm seeing it a lot now. Yeah, but they've always they've always had it. I don't. It's know always about that. it's always been there. I don't know about that. I no. say it's always been there. It's just I, now. I don't, even, man. I, don't, I don't even know if yeah I do have. I think it's because we're getting older. We're seeing people getting married, that but could like, be it too. but like, like but in general, a lot of people are still running away from relationships. Yeah. Be- uh, we, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say like okay every dude wants to eventually just settle down and just have a shorty that you know can just be like a like a partner, I mm-hmm. have a partner with right. But I think a lot of dudes are scared, including myself. I'm a little you know not scared. But Accountability. Cautious. I like that. That's what's up. Cautious. That's cautious the word. That's married. the word. Cautious. Without, without putting a prenup in debt. This guy and his prenup. Why are you why are you cautious? Man. What do you have to lose? We all man? know <laughs> what can what? happen. What? What do you have huh? to lose? You just said it. You already, you already know, man. You have a lot to lose. What do you mean you have a lot to lose? Losing is a serious Fine thing. Find love. A whole hmm? team? Find no, love. Honestly, <laughs> no, you heard me. I'm woman, <laughs> if you're married, right? Mm-hmm. You're not going to really initiate a breakup. Right? Okay. I feel like women initiate divorces more. Let's Google that. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think I think they do actually. I think women do initiate. I've heard that more. stat. Yeah, they yeah, do there is initiate a stat. divorces so, more. So right? what? So what? Hmm? So what? I mean, so what? You're gonna take off your shit like you tried to with the Afro Hakim. You can't. You can't power off the mind. You know, manifestation. Yo, honestly, you know, you, you can't go into though. something thinking about you the end. You can't, but you also shouldn't be unwise. I agree but with to that not, too. To not, to not, not be but cautious. you also have to start. Hmm? You also I'm have to start. Sure a lot of dudes said the same thing. Oh, I don't want to think. It's like better that to have loved and lost than never you know have mean? loved. At all? No, yeah. it's better to guard yourself first. Or guard but like, thing. how are you gonna like? Uh, don't take this the wrong Brother, way. Brother, I'm gonna say this: women emotions they change like day and night. So the guys, what the no, heck? No, I've no. seen it more with guys. How so? I've seen guys change their emotion like day way? and night. When the thing up, yes, baby, I love you. <laughs> What's wrong with this guy, bro? You know, no, I've no. literally <laughs> seen, I've literally seen oh, scenarios no. where mm-hmm. one moment the guy is flying the girl out, out, mm-hmm. having you know the best time of their life in a different country, and then literally as the girl gets back home, it, ghost. He ghosts her. Ghost. Oh, that's a tactic. You know why. Yes. How, how long? I don't know how long. Uh-huh. They but they were ta- they were talking like, how do you fly somebody out to another country mm-hmm. to be with you, spend time, have like the best time of your life? Don't sh- don't give any kind of indication that something's off. As soon as the girl goes back, like, uh, go sometimes certain ladies, why. it wasn't a real relationship. Sometimes you know with why. ladies, it, it they go back to the bullshit. No, it wasn't a relationship. But it doesn't matter if it's a real relationship. The point is, guys do it too. Would they no, change their emotions on and on? That's not a So let me let me ask you: Why would you, if if you were that person, what? Let's think of reasons why he would do that. Okay. Why why would it? Why do you think he did that? I have money. I want sex. You look good. Let me fly you over. Have a good time. Tristan, Boom. why do you think he would no, do that? No, but no. they were they were yeah. good, like good friends. Like they were in a good lot. It wasn't just the they were because good people friends don't know and they That's were keyword. oh friends. But they were good friends and oh, they friends. were like in a good like they were yeah. talking to each other for a while. So who's mm-hmm. gonna tell her? So it was, it's not just <laughs> tell, her. Tell, her. tell her what, tell her what, say it. They should dash out the thing. No. Wrong answer. That's why she got food out. That's why she got food out. Why? We're shocked. Mm. We're shocked. Okay. I'm puzzled. <laughs> so it was it was just for Panani. Yeah. Yes. Oh. I'm wasting money for what? For friendship? But Both the man he came begging back though, like years later. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, okay, so yeah. that's that's, oh, that's not that's not a flex. That's, that's not, not a flex. flex. Yeah, he came not begging back. Yeah. Well, well, that's that's men, men are possessive. That's, that's not a flex. The thing, the thing in this climate that a lot of ladies need to understand, which you ladies don't experience, is that men psychologically compete for women where women don't need to compete for men. You could just be there. And you got a nigga. A man have to do certain things, especially like states, different places across the world. A man has to say, yo, I'll fly you out. Let's fly out. Let's go here. Let's go there. They have to prove their dominance on a woman because what dominance is a woman proving to a man? 
Is you're not. Right? You're not going out there to get the man. The man has to impress you for you to say yes. But that yeah. still doesn't negate the point that men no, no, I guess that emotions change that. their emotions that. like night get, and day. I'm like no, no, I'm talking like, about your scenario. That's not emotional. That's not emotional. That's not emotional. It's not emotional. That, that's just, no, that is emotional. No, it's not. How's it emotional? Uh, hey, like okay, fine. He he flew her out trying to get the impress her to get the coochie or whatever. Didn't get it. Got got hurt. That's an emotion. Wait, feelings. That's an emotion. You got hurt. Yes, yeah, yeah okay. of course. Okay, spice. So like, spite if, spice. like, okay. Spice. First of all, well, you, you, that's like, if way. we're unpacking that scenario, like, how, okay. probably wasn't that scenario. But if we're laying it out like okay. that, he's a, he's a sucker. He's a sucker. How? Yeah, yeah. To be fair, you flew out a girl to try and get the coochie. Didn't get the coochie. Got butt no, hurt. He got the coochie. He didn't in that scenario. He I, didn't. I don't think he got the he coochie. Got the coochie. Otherwise, I don't think he, he got, got the coochie. coochie. No, I don't think he did. Reason why? Because he spent the block years later for her. <laughs> so what? Because for what? If that's not a player. Coochie, you don't have to. You that's don't not. Have to that's not a player. It. Player. You're there. I mean, that I ain't there, there, but that ain't pee. Like, <laughs> Let's put it this way. It's like this. Now I'll play my PlayStation Five. All right. Boo. I get mad. Whatever happens, I throw my controller. I'm like, fuck this shit. Like, oh shit, my control is precious. I'm gonna grab it. Never yes, you will. Back. Okay, but, in, in that huh? scenario, in that scenario, men are possessive. We're no, possessive. In, in that, possessive. Huh? in that scenario, I would say therapy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, therapy. Nah, if you hurt a girl, it's like, and, ah, I, and I think a lot of, a lot of, ah, fuck. I, I think get this pussy again, and it's like, oh fuck, I can't get this pussy again. It's like, okay, babe, like, you know, come on, like. And I say, sorry, and I, you know what I mean? Like, and for like those that. men, I say therapy. Hmm? I say therapy, because we think it's a flex. Or we give ratings for guys who are like, oh, who move like that. Cut girl off because they didn't give a coochie. Or cut girl off because I got the coochie. And spin the block later, say, hey, big head. Like, no, bro. You don't get ratings for that. Real no. real player shit is this. when you can have sex with a woman and, and, and go do other shit. And they're still cool with you. You know right. why? Because you're up front. You don't, you don't have to run no no psychological game on a woman I, to I, try I, to do I, things. I I like, what are you talking about? Like this. You, like, let's put it this way. Let, let's use this yeah. scenario. You're a man that used to talk about $40 days. You could do forty dollar dates and get coochie, and that guy had to fly a woman to another province, territory, and state to do bare things and get none. Think about that. We, we don't you did stuff now. here without even have to say I'll fly you out, and you could get coochie. So I get what I he's saying; pres- it's valid. Why? Why I don't present myself as a guy that can do that or a rich guy like that. You're right? being yourself. No, but I'm do you give ratings to guys who move like that? You're being yourself. Um, I. Do I rate them? I can't really. S- I, I can't, can't rate. Say, I can't say it, no or yes. I can't. That's, that's I, that's I, can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. It's never. It's that. Game has, is. It has never been a flex to me when guys are like hmm? showing off how they womanize, and I'm not trying to be a pick me or anything. Mm-hmm. It's just that like. <laughs> Good answer, hey, Steve. No, no, I'm not trying to be a pick me yeah. or anything. Oh, it is what it is. Because I've been hit with a. Some girls like guys with money, bro. I've been hit with a womanizer tag before. Some girls like guys with money, bro. No, I'm not talking about money part. Girls like guys with money. Yeah, I like most girls, women. Man. Most women. Right? I like so, your honesty. Yeah, guys usually pander to what they think women like. So, bro. Yeah, know. but then at the same time, you, you have to be oh, you have to be true to yourself, and I mean, you, you just get, said it. No, no, you can get it, but maintaining is a different story. You right? can maintain so, by being yourself, fams. You can. You can maintain it by right, being right, yourself. All right, all right, let's just say, yeah, you can. Realistically, look look at us. Okay, let, okay let's okay, look let me, at let us for example. Yes, you can, but there are also some girls that haven't kept. But that's off. No, I'm being realistic. That's bro. soft. Did you did you did, did you want to keep them? That's uh, soft. My simping days. <laughs> Why it has to be your simping days? Sir? Simping let's unpack that. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> let's unpack. Do we have the time? <laughs> <Stop yourself. laughs> have, you ever, have you ever thought about therapy? Do we have oh, the time? I like how you're trying to help your your brother <laughs> your brother and, and me. My simping days. <laughs> huh? My simping days. No, no, I'm tr- I'm switching subject now. Have you ever thought about therapy? What do I need therapy? Therapy is great. <laughs> Typical black answer. <laughs> what do I need therapy? <laughs> what? Huh? You know, I'm like, crazy. it helps with, like... Ah, the are, therapy. Are you, what? I already paid taxes to everything. I'm That's like, crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but some people feel like... Some people feel like they really don't need therapy. Well, I think I a lot therapy, of people... My therapy is a gym. I work out. That could be therapeutic, but mm-hmm. you still need to talk to somebody. I do. I talk to my brothers. I talk to you guys sometimes, you know what I mean? Yeah, but we're we're not working. At, I don't see. Uh, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't I think we need to upgrade. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I need to. I think, upgrade the doses. I think we need to upgrade the dosage. We need to uh, escalate this to the manager. <laughs> Who's the manager? That's the psychiatrist. Drew, have you ever thought about therapy? Um, as a black man. As a black man, 
I thought about it. Mm. I'm not opposed to it. Um, for me, I kind of just use myself as therapy to get by and figure things out. Obviously, there's moments where I talk to people and and state my feelings, but um, like I said, I'm not opposed to it. I've thought about it here and there. I don't think it's bad, depending on what the situation or the circumstance is, but because if you can handle it and you can go through it, go through it. But if you need someone to talk to, talk to somebody. I think there's nothing wrong with it. Crystal, do you feel like a lot of black men are like displaying their traumas on, or taking out their traumas on women? I know it's a heavy question to answer. It's vice versa, though, you know? Hmm? Damn, can we have a moment where we're not attacking women? <laughs> um. See, like, I, I feel like that's such a hard question to answer. I know it is, I know. Because we have to get to the bottom if we of wanna, If we want to follow social media, social media will always show you the worst of everything. Yeah, that's true. So, like, it's like it's hard. But, like, if I'm saying, like, in my immediate circle, in my immediate life, do I see that? No, I don't really see that. In yeah. my immediate circle, the a lot of the black men that I'm surrounded by, surrounded by mm-hmm. don't do that. They so don't, it's, it's they don't move ways or they don't need they therapy. Don't, I don't. They don't take out like they don't take out their traumas on the women in their life. Like a lot of the, the men I I see in my life that I'm surrounded with are very much protective of the women in their lives because it's growth. <clears throat> I mean, you can still be protective, but still like because like for example, I'm very protective of mine and the people I'm around, but I'm still closed off, and I know I'm closed off. But is that taking out your trauma? I, so this is how it would be displayed like like say I'm, I'm quiet or I'm having a moment and my partner wants to speak with me and because I'm closed off or something triggers something it it comes off on it it's like it's not taken out of them not yelling or whatever but that's that moment when I'm silent is kind of taking it out on them or it affe- from, affects from past them experience? Hmm? Is it from my past experience what do you mean like oh I've I've had the situation happen or whatever you know so this is I'm gonna handle it this time. Not not necessarily. You know what I mean? That's not a good question, but it's a good question though yeah, because there are person, people that like, are like that. Like from all the girls I dated and all that stuff and took out. I'm like oh I'm spending all this much money on dates and you know, this and that. Okay, let me cut this off and maybe not. Do a dinner, dinner, we have reached a root to the problem. <laughs> we, we, yeah, bro, I'm you, I do think a lot of I men, though, it. and this no, kind of goes back seven. to the conversation that we had earlier, and I don't know if this has anything to do with trauma, but I do feel like a lot of a lot of y'all men are attracted to like crazy, crazy women. We love bad girls because I <laughs> see there's so many good women out there that are like. So many single out there. There's a lot of good single women out there. But what makes you think they're good? Be good at first, as long as you don't piss them off. I mean, like they're not, they're not crazy. Like I be, I hear some crazy. Your crazy friend ain't gonna show their craziness around you. No offense, I'm not saying your friends are crazy. I'm just okay, but like I don't know. I just feel like just like how these guys are not gonna show their toxic trait because they have none. I definitely feel like pretty privilege <laughs> is a huge thing when yeah. it pretty com- privilege when it comes to like 100% dating 100% and I, and I guess it, you can maybe it goes I don't know if it, it I don't know if it goes both, I don't know if it goes both way to the same extent but like y- a lot of men will put up with a lot of BS facts it goes both ways as long as the girl looks good uh, I think that is weak, true I think a weak man does that that's not true yeah, you trying to call me weak? Huh? You trying to call me weak? Um, you you trying to call there, Tristan no, weak? No, there is tolerable. You trying to call stuff. yourself weak? Huh? You trying to call yourself no, weak? No, I didn't take that stuff. One hundred percent. Do we have to turn the cameras off for you? Sorry, stuff? I think you can turn the cameras off. Because Sorry, I'm on my phone. I'm about, I was actually you're talking about good women. I was trying to GPS it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so you are saying you don't know any good women my in your bad. life? No, my you bad. You, I, you said there's a lot, I, yo, so I was trying to Google Juicy, a lot. Juicy, Juicy. You don't know any good women? I feel like y'all need to change your circles. 
yeah. we don't have a circle. It's a line. <laughs> <laughs> what circle? Like there was ever a circle. There's a line. You, how that, how so. can you say that there's not a lot of good women? Good women? Okay. Yeah. There's there's ladies that say that they're good, <laughs> but then when you really talk to them, mm-hmm. it's crazy. Well, what it's not makes crazy, crazy, bro. It's not We're not going to get it's, into it's, detail. It's, Each to you, them one. It, it's very, there are good women, but it's very, very. That maintain the goodness. And I'll be honest with you, I had a good girl. Not not this recent one. I have another good girl. Oh, before. so the recent one's not good? No, he's no, saying and. Good. Oh, okay. Before. Okay. He's saying he, he thinks this good one, this choices. This more, you know, whatever. Okay. Good for crazy. Okay. Okay. But I see, a, you, I, see this, you see the smile when he, he said crazy? Huh? Men he do, likes it. Men do love crazy. I know you guys love crazy. I know you guys like it. Yes, you do. I know you guys like it. I'll, say, no, I'll put this on the what? podcast. No, oh, my dad, I don't. Crazy, Must mm-hmm. be crazy. You have to have some kind of spice. There is a limit. You see some some type of spice. What's the spice? What's the what's the spice? We're not talking Scotch bonnet. What's it called? Schofield. I can't really discuss it too much on this podcast. Oh, because um, and you're not gonna put this clip on. I'm definitely putting this clip on. Say it. No, because. The shorty I watch is probably like my clips of podcasts and stuff like that. <laughs> there is, there is nothing. Crazy, crazy. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. No, 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 no. Freeze, freeze, freeze. Let me put up. Let me put a pause on this. Whatever you have said on this podcast <laughs> from the beginning of when we started it, they yeah. all know who you are. So you oh, can, whatever. and they still want you. So they still want you. Crazy. There was a crazy girl. Mm-hmm. All right, that you know. I was kind of talking to not really, but you know, just, I'm like, nah, it's too crazy for me. Mm. Mm. There were some conversations. Yes, like there was some discussion there, there, of a deal, crazy. but there wasn't a contract and signed. Like, oh fuck, Wimis. Yeah, <laughs> there's Wimis. So I don't. Men don't like. We like a little bit of spice, but not crazy. Okay. And if we do, it's only a limit of how long we're gonna take that bullshit. Saying it's like the Osmos line. Do you want one line? Do you want the X? Do you want the circle with yeah, the pepper? Sure. She's not gonna watch this either, but you know, You're I'll fine. tell you off camera the crazy shit. Like you know what I mean? The, okay, I the, the cameras is off for the crazy shit. All right, all right. Think that. No, all, my my experience, I think all women are crazy at some, at, at some level. So it just depends on the man yeah, and the scenario. Now, you can ask. Yeah. What makes them crazy? I'm pretty sure in a way. I'm you're I'm very crazy. curious. I'm, sure I'm very crazy. crazy right? Huh? I'm pretty sure in a way you're crazy. You have some craziness to you, 100. percent I I don't know. Am I? I don't think so. Someone doesn't push your buttons too far. Then. Come touch me now. Touch the button. I don't know. Like I don't know. I was thinking that. Too. I'm just like I'm trying to think of like what. Yeah. There are good women, but it's not. It's what very... someone would do to push my button so far that would like make me do something crazy. Because there's no way a woman can tell me, oh, all women or most women are not crazy. Because like you said, society puts it out there <laughs> and it shows you what woman will go to to prove. Yeah, the lengths to prove a point. And... What bothers me is that society or social media? Society, because we social media is society. Social media is a fragment of society. There's a, a I mean, big so, social media is society, society now. Not on social, social media. media is society some girls, now. okay. I'm just saying, like some girls like to play the stupid cat and mouse game. What's cat and mouse? They'll give Tom some and Jerry attention and then hopscotch. It's like hopscotch. It's like hopscotch, and then just like oh, they pull back. That little stupid shit. You know? Oh, okay. Oh, you talking about is that, is that is that a uh, crazy trait? No, that's just a Gemini. Whatever it is. Usa. You know? I, I think it's, I think it's She's manipulation. She's a wolf, but... Manipulation, okay. Manipulation. It is a little bit crazy. I know a lot of girls that do that. Um, I have you. I have you, right? <laughs> I, like, oh, I've done that before. Now, now, when you stop... Oh, you've done that before. I've done that before. You've done that before, right? I've done that Now that when you stop... Ah. Account- accountability. Yeah, I love so it. When you stop... What the fuck are you that they do? You and then they, yeah. they come back. Oh, my God. Ooh. Come back. Come back. You know? And then y'all come back. <laughs> so, because we remember how yeah. good the pum pum was, come on. Yeah, and then you know, <laughs> Dude, I, I, come on. Actually, you know when that happens? You know, you know what I do? I slay it bad. <laughs> so that kind of thing that never happens again, man. That's now great. I'm, in control. <laughs> I'm the captain of the ship now. Look at that. Do what you want to do. Do what you want to do. Okay, you want to do that? Okay, I'm out. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, you know. So, 
The toxic Interesting. Mesh. Interesting. Is. Very interesting. It is. How, I like how you held yourself accountable, though. You admitted that you actually do yeah, those that, type of that's things. that's crazy. Like, what are you doing? I've done that why, before. Why? Why? Yeah. why? Can we ask why? What, <laughs> what in your right mind wanted you to do something like that? And who persuaded you to go um, do it? To be honest, I feel like... Okay, I, I can't talk for all girls, but I for me, I only did that to guys that I didn't really like. Wow. Like, if I just... If I didn't really like them like that, like maybe if it was just like a physical attraction thing, then then maybe it was like you'll toy with their emotions, toy a little bit. But if I actually genuinely like this guy and let's see, like okay, a, like a future with this person, I would not. I ha- would not. Have, have you ever done inten- that. Have you ever intentionally well, flaked on a person? Flaked? Yeah, like made plans with one of these guys that you didn't like, and then last minute be like, oh, I overslept, or or. Made an excuse. No, I've, I've never made plans. Mm. Sorry, mm. Did, did the person make yeah. the plan for you? You didn't show up. Let's just say. No, that. no, 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 no. I would never do that. I would never do that. Have would you, you entertain a person you didn't like? That's the whole thing. I've, no, I've done, done that before. She's entertaining. Wow. And then, mm. I've that's done that see, before. And then that's why y'all women are. Actually, okay, rapid yeah. fire. Have you ever went out with someone for free food? All the time. Stop it. For free food. Or for, or for a free time out. That, that's, like, a, that's, a com- that's a commandment in the woman Bible. Mm. Oh, don't do, kill me. Do fifth that's, that's a commandment in the woman's Bible. That's a good one. Knowing, oh. knowing that I didn't really genuinely like the person. Yeah. It still went out there either on a date or for free food. Don't say no. She's Might thinking of a time I don't, didn't do it. I don't know. No, honestly, to be honest, I don't think I have. I No, and I'm being very gentle. I'm being very honest. I don't think I have. Yeah. Um, I I was tempted to do it with with one tempted. person. A tempted murder. <laughs> I was very tempted to do it with one person, but then I just kind of felt like I don't really have the, I don't really have the time. Mm. Uh, so but back to like, one of the questions when you said uh <laughs> you've done that to a person. Now has a person ever like okay, now stop responding or stop doing like respond to your 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 games and then you're like where's this guy and you feel away. No. No, okay. Because if I don't, if I genuinely don't like like you like that, if you stop responding, it's like okay, <laughs> on to the next, on to the next. Uh, uh. Oh, Yo, women are y'all are wicked and wicked. <laughs> like I said, I've done no, that no, before. Honestly, bro, it's I not think... something that I like. It's like something I'm proud of. But I'm just, you know, it's just something I can I can recognize and be like, you know what. You're describing it. I'm just yeah. like, okay, you know, I have done that before. It's not like and I'm you, proud I of it. I personally think women are, are a little bit more wickeder than men. Personally. Oh, absolutely. 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 You know why? Because women can do what men can do and get away with it better than what men can do. You think sometimes, women are wickeder than men? Yeah. Absolutely. I don't know about women are wickeder than men. They might just be slyer. Listen, more man. slick wicked, Yeah Wicked More slick But I don't know about wicked Because if you reversed it You'd have said Mans are wicked for doing it Like in what sometimes, sense Like for like, What example some, Hold on I'm just saying, Sometimes like I don't think so What a girl so. says something to me And like Damn Like don't you have a nigga yo <laughs> Yeah Like one time Don't you got a man Don't, don't got a man <laughs> Why are you trying <laughs> To wow. be my girl But men do that all the time <laughs> Listen, no, listen. Bro, okay, let me listen, say this. Like, no. Not to say, it's, not to say it's wrong. That can 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 I say it? Or but no, guess what? But this. guess like, what? Like, but guess I what? I know you're you in your head. You're like, damn, don't you have a nigga? But I know you also feel good on. The, you also feel uh, you also feel nice on the no, inside. It's not that I feel nice, and I don't get no ratings for this or anyone that does this. No ratings for this, but it's just like I have to do a job here. You still you uh-huh. still have to do something. With the girl, or do I still do something you with still the girl? do something with but the girl. But here's here's here here this here this. Of course, huh? it's my of course. Mind. You know what? Here's <laughs> oh, here this super <laughs> negro over here, <laughs> super <laughs> side dick. You know what? <laughs> you know, here I come you know to I save the day, super, uh, super uh, side uh, nigga. Uh, no, I used to be the yeah. I would. Super backup dancer, like <laughs> no, because so I'm funny. not. Oh, oh baby, baby, baby. No. Captain, take it for the team, <laughs> like no, this is a job I'm gonna do right now. You know, yeah. I'm not saying you get ratings for. You Bro, know. we apply for that. Well, Indeed. You know what? 
everybody. Happens to everybody. Happens to everybody. Like I said, when it comes to when it comes to those situations. So is is this is that why you fear is that why you fear relationships so much? What? The cheating part. Because it could happen to you. Anyone can get cheated on. Yo, anybody can get cheated on. You you fear guys I think they're not getting cheated on, they're getting cheated on. Like you? No. So how? <laughs> so how? If you have that, if if you have if you have that if you have that framework, like how are you gonna manage being in a relationship or marriage? No, I try not to think about it. You know, just have fun and stuff like that. I don't think about that shit no more. <laughs> what do you mean? I don't think about that thing, thing no more. more. But honestly, bro, from what I've seen, I said women are wicked, man. No. I want, okay, I want to smash the girl in the back. You know what? I want in her car, and she's just like, I'm just gonna leave the cum stain there. In her car? Yeah, I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, yo, not clean. He's like, no, just leave it. I'm like, why? I'm just gonna blame. She's like, I'm just gonna blame it on some spilled like yo. fucking ice cream or some shit. I'm like, what the fuck? I, and I couldn't believe. Are they it. nice to so put- huh? I, I couldn't believe it. And that's not the oh. only thing. Like, is that thing. wickedness or is that just that is dirtiness? I think that's wickedness. That's just dirty. That's no. dirty. No, she that's had a she had a man. Yeah. Oh, whose car was it? Hers. Oh. But you still, I like how you're trying to put the beast But you the still smashed. Me. I did. Knowing she had a man. What does that yeah. say about you, sir? <laughs> Yo, not them getting at the What back. does it say about me? Mm-hmm. You had a job to do. Can, I say, your, can I say your phrase? Yes, you are scum. She's calling on me to do the job. Fuck, I'm, I'm doing the job. Call me a contractor. Okay. <laughs> but I, I want I want you to put some more I, I want you to put some more respect on your your on yourself. Your, yourself. Uh, like, like you have to like, you have to think about the energy. <laughs> <laughs> like, if you if you were my son or if you were my brother, I'd be like, I need you to put some more respect on yourself. Hold you on, know let me, this, let me ch- you know this girl has a, a man. Let me try to. Why you feel like you need to be this? But be proud. The sign, the sign nigga. Low key, you'd be a little bit proud. Let me. Hold on, hold on. Nobody's saying. Would I be proud? Yes, you are. Low key, I would. Yes, you are in that situation. I'm just smashing it. That's a side nigga shit. How's that side nigga? If you spend more okay, than five minutes with someone, being, then you're if, the sneaky If you link. spend more than five minutes with a woman that is not Bro, yours, you're a side nigga. Listen, Drew, Drew, and I'm pretty sure you know this. And Drew's probably done this too, man. That's you're, crazy. You're the sneaky know. link. Drew's done this too. How many girls just like, yo, more than five minutes? I can even talk to the girl. I can't buy. That's it. So what? Well, what happens? Happens? Life. You're the sneaky link. Huh? You're the sneaky link. Hey, call the sneaky link or what? I'm not committing to them, so I don't see myself as a second or side dude. I'm just living my life. Just live your son, life. Son, son, just like something a side nigga would say. But you don't do, but you don't do that anymore. No, I don't. No, I feel I, like I get, I get, I've matured. You know what I mean? But right. I did it because, delivered. Listen, I did it because that was last week, by the way. <laughs> wow. No, nah. don't do my my actually, brother right dirty now, like that. Actually, control who I have sex with and who I do. You you should kind of leave with that because people be thinking y'all do you did this like last week. No, 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 I don't. You know, I expect. Years ago, huh? I, you know, I, I, I want you to to want more for yourself. You know, you don't have to be these side niggas oh, yeah, and. I was in a relationship. What are you talking about? <laughs> Not no, no, the like, my guy. In those, in those situations. <laughs> what are you talking about? Ten years yeah, ago. It was so bad that after I left my relationship, mm-hmm. I got neutered, and I felt like I'm neutered. Like I went, to I, I went to go chop a girl, and I was like so rusty. Holy. So rusty. Huh? That's what did you, you know. say? Yeah. So I was like, you know. All faithful and stuff like that. I went to chop a girl and I'm like, yo, I, I froze. I'm like, this shit hasn't happened to me since I was like. And all my yeah. life. Everybody, yeah. everybody, just be I careful out there. Someone like you. <laughs> Apparently, I'm throat cancer, thing. throat cancer is on the rise. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Throat cancer. What, yeah. madam? What do you mean by yeah. that? Due to a- HPV. Mm-hmm. I know, I know, I know a Scarborough girl with a, a throat with a switch on it. What? She has a throat. With a switch, That's crazy. A well, switch? I'll say this. Yeah, with so a I switch. Gotta, I gotta go. Um, Due to smoking or throwing or what? I did all that. No, she just sick with the got got nine hundred. Me, right? It's a circle of life. Wait, next month. Wait, what? wait, it's wait, circle of life. Wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> it's the circle. Wait, wait, wait. I want, you to, I want you to say what you're gonna say, yeah. but wait, what? wait. What did you just say? I said I, I know a Scarborough <laughs> girl because you said the throat cancer thing. Yeah. Just, it just reminded me, like, yo. I know a, St- a Scarborough girl and she had a, a throat with a switch on it. You mean a switch, switch meaning like what? Like a switch. Like, you know, like this, the Shy Rat nigga said he got a Glock with a switch? Jeez. I don't know what oh, a switch she is. Throw go? She throw go? For the dumb people. <laughs> yeah. Throw go? Yeah, the Glock 9000 I don't know what switch. a switch is. Jeez. Like she's bad. She's automatic with it. 
Automatic. Like she has a knife in her throat? The thing goes not really a church girl, eh? No, That's good, I, yo. What is a switch? Let's protect switch. her innocence. What is a switch? You know what switch is? Don't go to the no, dark honestly, side. No, honestly, I really don't. Don't go to the dark side. We, like, so, it's like we know who's thing. not going to act on power. <laughs> yeah, basically, okay, so if we're talking this, you know, whatever like a, term that this guy likes yeah. to use. If you shoot a, a, a thing. Uh-huh. Right? A gun. It's, it's like manual. You have to click it. Uh huh. switch is like... The, it once and it's like the thing goes so skibbity pop pop boom mm-hmm. you're done now basically you're done <laughs> you're done now your, 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 your wood skibbity pop oh switch. okay you have to control that free up <laughs> wait so wait, wait up. does she have throat cancer oh my god <laughs> nah, man. Oh, she's a throat goat oh she's a throat goat okay uh, Okay, I am. <laughs> and with that, wait, the innocence. Is wait, wait, so wait, wait, wait. Say what you were gonna say. Uh, what was I talking about? Oh, really? I don't know what you were gonna say. But you're oh, gonna. Oh, basically, like, yeah. Um, why smash? It? Like, because you said it happened to you. you yeah, said. man. Like, you know, it was a different mindset though. But it's like, okay, what the hell? The next man's gonna do it to me. Like, why? Why do I care about the next man? You know what I mean? Oh, Let me do this thing, my job. So. Oh, it's man. funny how you and consider quite, that your honestly, job, but okay. even till now, a dude will still try, even if he knows you have a girl. So it's just like, to me, it's just a circle of life. Wait, you say you still do it now? No, I don't do it now. Uh, I have a little more decorum sense. Let me just say something. You know? I don't want karma to move karma happening on me. Move right. my skin. You know? And you said you're in a relationship. No, I'm not. Not right now. So. But I thought you said you had to leave early for love. Now are you exposing? You're not exposing me like that, man. God damn it, you're gonna edit this out. <laughs> Did he say that? Did he say that on, like oh, while the cameras what? were rolling? No, he said he has to go do a shift. No, didn't he literally say that while the cameras were rolling? No, no he said he had to go do a shift. Okay, he said he had to go done. work. Okay, so he has to go go do a work shift. He's okay. doing the Lord's work. Come on. Okay. What, 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 what y'all think about this this clip okay. that we saw online? <laughs> That you said that you cannot teach a man or tell a man how to be a man. So I will not ask you to indict men in this question. But I do want you to speak, Ayanla, to how women need to, uh, I don't know, position ourselves so that we can be in our divinity, so we can have our crowns right, how we can create and not build. When some of us, quite frankly, feel that the men that are available to us, and I'm talking about across the color spectrum, across the age spectrum, trust me, I've done them all, um, they are not positioned to protect nor provide because of some of the statistics we just talked about. They're not earning the incomes. They're not having the resources, and some of them are not even showing up in the leadership. Standards and requisites, and I'm not talking about him laying on his sofa playing video games all day. (laughs) I'm not talking about that. But the standards and the criteria that we use to measure men is off for who we are as women and who they are in this society. I would date a bus driver if he was, if he loved driving the bus, if he was a man of integrity, if he was good to his mama, if he treated me well, I would date a bus so basically she said the part Eben, Ebony K. Williams yeah, yeah she said she would not date a bus driver but a look on her face she said no that's a bus driver what's no, that no I didn't, I didn't say that but listen <laughs> I've, cause I've been hearing the conversation about this like for the past two days people were coming at Ebony K. Williams about her decision but you have to remember Ebony K. Williams is like a millionaire right so she has money though. I think she I, I think she's a millionaire I'm pretty sure she's a millionaire. So she's a woman with. I don't think there's the anything least. wrong with her wanting a man that has that's like of equal status to her. I don't. I don't think it's. Here's the thing, I don't think it's wrong to have a preference, but don't disrespect everybody else's. I think that's the problem with a lot of women nowadays. There is nothing wrong with you saying that. If mm-hmm. you say, okay, I don't want to date a bus driver, fine. Mm-hmm. But don't go on like say bus drivers don't make money. Don't go on like or say, healthy yeah, like a- like there's bus drivers, there's maintenance people that are living a very healthy life. Mm-hmm. So when the problem is nowadays is women are saying, I prefer this. I wouldn't date a bus driver. He's this, 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 that. He must be. Di-. It's like you don't. You've never dated one to say that. You know what I'm saying? That's like that's like me saying to a, to a group of women, I wouldn't date a woman that has only fans because all they want to do is. Is, is fling vagina to beer mans. 
and they have no integrity and no this and no that. Maybe there are some ladies that do OnlyFans that have some integrity, some respect, some some principles. Maybe they're just doing that for the time being until they get to a certain level of success and leave. So, but if you say you don't want to date a girl that does OnlyFans, I don't think anyone's gonna come at you. Yeah, you get you get what I'm saying. You're you're basically repeating what I'm saying. If I said that, that's not the problem. It's me saying, oh, all the 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 OnlyFans girls are just mere skeptals and and they don't know nothing about commitment and all that. That's when it starts getting more disrespectful. Would if you, you don't like OnlyFans, fine. You don't want to date a bus driver, fine. You don't want to date a maintenance man, fine. That's your choice. But so don't be like, oh, I don't want to date because they don't make this money and that money and they're whack. It's like, come on. See the 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 problem. Okay, so she's speaking for herself. Great. For herself, fine. fine. But when you have a platform, and especially with how men are being attacked in or portrayed in the media, you have to have a certain way of seeing certain things. So can she say she doesn't want a bus driver? Yes. yes. But she has to articulate that because of my profession, where I am, certain lifestyle that I have, I can't date someone who's not at a certain um, level. At a certain level that I, I am. Mean. That's how That's she should have worded it. She That's cool. Saying she, yeah, she probably still would have got torched. But saying, <laughs> saying she, she, you, me, data bus driver. I'm sorry, who? No, it comes off a poor. certain way. Yeah. Oh, the poor. The, how you do the poverty? <laughs> like, bad. and uh, hey, not everybody's in the one percent or the ten percent or the the fifteen percent. And that's that's the problem with a lot of ladies. They want men that make the hundred k, the two hundred k, the three hundred k. And it's like, first of all, you're not even making that. You're not even making a K. You're not even making a K. Second of all, do you think the 100K, 200K, 300K is going to be looking for you? No. They're no. Not, they're not going STC. <laughs> like, yeah, they're not like 100K is a lot of money. Hmm? It's no, not. but we're not, we're not saying that. What we're saying is, regardless if a man makes 50K, 60K, 70K, 80K, 90K, like she said, as long as the man makes money, as long as a man has a passion, a man enjoying himself, because you're you're looking at all the hundred k and forgetting he can have a hundred k and still treat you like shit. He can have a hundred k and still abuse you. And there's women right now today. I'll say it straight. There's women right now today that are still with dudes because of the status and not because of the intellect inside of them. Because they know that that man has a good amount of money that gives them that lifestyle, and they rather stay with the lifestyle and get hurt, be abused, get treated like garbage, than to leave and find someone that probably can less financially, but give them more internally. Because emotionally. love, emotionally, because because emotionally, because love don't pay the I bills. I think it's unfortunately. both. You definitely need both. You need some you. Because you still need to... You can't have 100K and not you everybody has it. I'm saying not everybody can do that. Not every man can get 100K. Not saying it's not possible, but in this climate, in this time, in this society at area it takes, it takes a lot of work. It takes a lot of work. But it takes a lot of work. But so you like can't for these rich that. rich folks, they're like warping the minds. Not, not just women, but like men too. They're warping the minds and some of these men out here trying to get the fast money because they're trying to impress these women yeah. to like doing these car theft and these, these, these scamming and all that stuff. Their nine to five is paying good, but... They have to get more because they have to live up to certain the woman. expectations. So it's just like a vicious cycle that we're in. It's not much. that you need to necessarily need to get the hundred k, but you need to have mm-hmm. stability. But. You need to be able to like I don't want to, and I think the reason why a lot of women might be like, "Oh, I don't want to date a bus driver or whatever," is because they're thinking about, okay, if I date a bus driver, how much income is he bringing in? Then is a lot of the financial burden going to be placed on me, which a lot of women <laughs> don't want that. Why? Is a lot of financial burden going to be placed on me as a woman? How are we going to be living month to month? If Are we going to be struggling month to month because of his salary? And I think that's a lot of reason. I think that's a reason why a lot of women might think, okay, I don't want to date a bus driver or I don't want to date a, this or this, 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 because they're thinking this about... They're oh, thinking what? about the finances and like the stability and like how their life is gonna and it's not and it's not even necessarily oh I want to live a lavish life it's just I don't want to struggle and I, I don't think there's anything wrong with not wanting to struggle. But you're gonna have. I see. I, 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 I see why Dwayne really wants to be a woman. It's just like, <laughs> like. It, the, 
No, for real though, because it's just you know like. Wants to be a woman one more time. I probably yeah, everybody <laughs> does that. but I see why a lot of I see why like these days you have a lot of uh, men who want to be women because the privileges that they get like you know, not, not saying you intentionally worded it that way but like a lot of women don't want to have to worry about the financial burden it's just like you guys are it's like a privilege where you get to p- handpick people to take care of you for the rest of your life, but that's how as adults, that's how, that's how you hear that? You hear how that sound? But that's how it, it, it was big, a lot imagine, of the time. Imagine this. Imagine in this. Big age. <laughs> imagine this. But that's how it was a lot. That's how it, and that's how it is for a lot. Of, and I don't. And a lot of, and it's only it's only people really in North America. I find men in North America that have an issue with that because like North America globe, is tough. The rest of the globe. They don't have an issue with men being men, and men want to take care of women. You know why? Because in the rest of the world, rest of the globe, like the cost of living ain't the same. I seen a TikTok video where a man said his 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 rent for the year is thirty dollars. He makes a hundred dollars a year in his country. Where is this? In third world. Uh, can't remember the African country, but let's go Jamaica. Jamaica minimum wage is like ten grand a week. Translate that to. Uh, Canadian it's like I think it's uh, 150 call it that roughly 150 a week in Jamaica you could have a backyard with fruits you don't have to spend much on groceries if you want to raise a couple chickens you can raise a couple chickens so in those scenarios if the man is the breadwinner because of the the economy that he lives in it's easier for him to do now in, in North America it's a little bit different where you see a lot of people. Ha- Drew, how much jobs do you have? Five. Tristan. Two. No. <laughs> Ron. Two, three. But we're Jamaican. That's our. That's our. Little, that's our. Day. No, but still. But that's but think day. about it. Think about it. Still. Think about it. As women, y'all y'all fear or worry is finding a man who's going to be financially stable to take care of you and your family. Our fear is having. The fear that we're not going to be able to have a fourth and a fifth job to take care of our women and, and our family. And yeah. Do you see, the we, see that the, the difference is we we're not there's men no one to bail us different. out. Huh? Like I don't I don't but know the, what you ex- want me to say. No, but what I'm saying is different. What I'm saying here is yes, we're different, but our struggles are not the same. And I'm not trying to do the struggle Olympics here. All I'm trying to do is point out the fact that like women just have this privilege where. Um, when they become adults, they get the privilege of being a, a child again That's by, by finding a safe haven under men to take care of them. Meanwhile, men, we don't have, we don't have a, it's us. It's us against it's the world. It's us. We don't, we can't go to our daddy to get, get some Espe- money. Especially when you're a black man. <laughs> especially when you're a black man. <laughs> That's great. When, especially when you're a first generation Canadian. Oh, I'm not even a first dude. generation Canadian. I'm fresh off the boat. <laughs> I agree. I agree. And I, I get that's why some men have their like mental breakdowns and exactly. stuff. Exactly. Or some men just become womanizer. They say, fuck it. Like, I can't I can't do it. I'm just gonna have to take care of myself. I have a youth, I have a youth, and that's it. I can't do the family thing. You know what? And the funny thing about it is when you go on all these social medias and you look at even the people that have the money, like I've watched a lot of people talk about it and even the people that have the money even say yo don't disrespect the mandem that are the bus drivers of the big they're making bread like yeah. mans can make it work it's just women want those guys up there and the guys up there are saying yo what i used to be this mm. <laughs> i used to be this like lebron james savannah, um savannah james you think LeBron James was rich in the beginning? No. Drew, let me ask you this. Do you? No. He right, was Tristan, recognized. Tristan, let me ask you this. Do you do you have a, a fear that you're you might not be able to provide everything your family needs in the future? Of course. Does it does it bother you? Speak on the mic. Does it does it bother you constantly? I, I, I you make it sound like it's taking over my kind of is. But yes, um, of course, yeah. Once again, this is why I don't really. Like in relationships, I don't want to get into relationships until I know I have myself together or I can. You don't want to say I have a little something stable too. Mm-hmm. 
because I don't want to be that guy. I'll, you know, I want to be able to provide for him the. Person. Do you want to have like a, like at least a foothold of things before you have that added pressure that the woman is gonna bring into your life? <laughs> you keep it a bug, bro. <laughs> you ain't lying. It's a good it's question. Not, but it's funny. It's like yes, it's gonna happen. Yes, she and, is. And and this you know. and this, I feel like I'm not a therapist or anything. I'm just an observationist. I, I feel like this is why a lot of men they just waste waste women time and waste their time too, because they're they're seeing it from a standpoint where yo, I can't do it. I can't do it. You can't win. At I all. can't. I can't do it. And can't a lot of them are just ending up being womanizers, or and then what men, women are gonna be like, oh, women, men can't take, men, we can't take men serious or that, and then we have to settle for the the sugar daddies and the scammers or the yeah, the, the, and the, the quote unquote nerd that has it figured out but doesn't have the social skills to keep your attention. But you know, he went to tech school and have a tech Fox. job right now. Well, tech job is kind of. Flaky right now, depending on where you are. Facts, but like, it's it's it's, it's, it's rough out here. It's rough. So it's like when you say that there's good women out there, there's some good men too. But the only reason, but the only reason why women are saying there's not much good men because some of the good the men money. are bus drivers, <laughs> dishwashers, <laughs> maintenance people that they don't consider that could provide. But, like, let's be real, though. Let's be real. I know some bus drivers that are providing very well. If you're a dishwasher. It, you can make it happen. How much money are you making? You can make it happen. No, let's let's be I'm, real. I'm how telling much, you. In, in in Toronto. I'm telling you. No, no, no. Let's, let's, let's not... Let's, let's bring up, like, actual facts. I was in, in the position. In Toronto, mm -hmm. you're just a dishwasher. How much money just, are you making? You're not just. 20 bucks an hour? You have ambition to have multiple hustles. Twenty bucks an hour. Okay, but if and that's but then week. but that's different. Okay. If mm -hmm. you're have multiple hustles, then you're not just a dishwasher. But if you're a dishwasher and that's like your sole means. sole means of income, oh. what are you, how are you how are you even providing for yourself, especially you, living? You know, in, in do the you GTA? know that? Do you know that you can actually? Yeah, she's right on that part to a degree because I actually used to be a dishwasher. And it's funny that you say that because I started at a certain rate and then within three months, I got $5 extra plus tips every week. So people can say, well, you, you doing a dishwasher, you don't make much money. You'd be surprised that you can still ask for more money, still be in the same position and still make a living. You can still ask for more money all you want. There's with certain industries, certain jobs you're gonna a have cap. a cap that's true. of there's how much you can make, and that's just the reality. So then twenty. So then if you had fifteen, and they give you, let's say, what minimum wage right now is like sixteen ninety or sixteen seventy five. Minimum is sixteen. It went up. I think it went up April first. Yeah, it went April first. So if let's say the man had made sixteen something, 11. you make twenty five dollars an hour. Now he's mm -hmm. working eight hour shifts. For five days Minimum a week. wage is not $25. No, no. I'm saying if he, he started at 60, mm -hmm. right? And he gets a raise. They give him like he asked for something. And his cap is $25. I don't know. No dishwasher that's making $25. I know. I know a few. I don't know about I know that. A few. I don't know about that. I, I know, know about a few. That. I really don't know about you that. You may not, but I do. Because I'm that. in that industry. I don't know about that. I, I know. know a few. I know a few. Doing more Plus, than I can, <laughs> yes, I know a few. I'm in it. But even, but even if, honestly speaking, even if it's 25, it's still not enough. Times eight. That's okay. Times. It's still not. That's like 40k a year. It's a living. It's not the worst. It's bare minimum. People that are making 70k are still struggling. Yeah, it's just not we enough. We talked about people mm. lining up for food banks. Yeah, a lot of those, those. A lot of those people are are working class people like are making well above minimum so, wage so like well also it, depends the problem the problem isn't the people the problem is um the society like the price of everything that's, that's what i'm saying that's, that's, the, that's what i'm that's saying so like here. if we're living in the gta mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. we're talking about in the gta you can't fault a woman that says i don't want to date somebody that maybe is a quote unquote dishwasher because if they're thinking about their the economic society that they live in 
how are we how are we no like, no we're not we're not I, I understand saying, that we're not saying that that part is bad what we're saying is don't disrespect to a point where it's like you're degrading that job because it can't do anything a work is a work still work was, is a work I was at in, the end of I the day in, i was in dollarama um getting something and, and a guy probably like fresh fresh to canada he, he came to the cashier when i was there and said yo uh I'm, I have a, a resume. I'm looking to get the job. <laughs> yeah, he said a resume. Sorry, you can't. Yeah, it, but it's on there. and I, I chuckled for I chuckled in my head for a bit. He said resume, and then I'm like, yo, fuck. Yeah, yeah. This is what we live and in this is not the first time, bro. Is that like multiple times when I'm at the checkout of these places, people are walking up and trying to get a job. And sometimes yeah. when I'm finished work, when I'm like, yo, fucking hell, yo, uh, tired of this 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 work that I'm in. I still have to be grateful because yeah. man's wish to be in our position to even our, have not even my position like a I don't like a minimum wage position. Yeah. yeah. So at the end of the day, it's like I get that we want stability. We all want stability. Of we're, we're fighting the wrong battle. We shouldn't be fighting with each other about how much you make. Can you support me? Blah blah blah. We should be fighting the system. Facts. These, these bills need to come down. Facts. Bring back five dollar lunchbox. Facts. That's what that's like, what the lady should. That's yeah. what the lady should be talking that. about. <laughs> Toonie <laughs> Tuesdays when it was actually a Toonie. Go back to that. Yo, bring back these low prices. Yeah, that's what that's what bring lady back, should be fighting about. Bring Not back twelve hundred dollar twelve hundred dollar condos. Yeah, and it like, was roomy instead of this yo i seen i seen i seen uh, on tiktok somebody advertising a condo it says 2500 downtown i'm like oh shit that's decent and it's this no 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 <laughs> it was for a roommate it's, the rent is actually 5000 that's crazy but they're, they're being slick now where they're renting it out by oh you and your roommate can rent down here for 25000 each wow they're slick with how they cuz everything is going up everything. but let me ask you all this before we wrap up you didn't ask no film questions. Yeah. Um, hold on, let me just... Uh, oh, that camera the thing died. Okay. Ask, ask the questions, though. All I know is, like... Just under his bed. Like, the fact of the matter is, there's nothing wrong with a lady having a preference. But just don't disrespect those that are actually hustling doing the jobs that certain mans wouldn't do because that's also what makes society run you can look at the the you know the one percentile you can look at these multi-million dollar companies if it wasn't for the the dishwasher if it wasn't for the, the chef if it wasn't for the the all these little basic jobs the corporation would even be making the money it's making i agree you know what i'm saying so that's why with me, when it comes to dating, I personally don't care if a woman, like, where she works, as long as she's working and have ambition to be bigger than what she is. That's my concern. Cause but you I feel can, like it's different for men, though. Men aren't really looking at women to be their, like, to be their support or, like, provider. or Like, it's, it's different. Because we can. Because we'd be... be <laughs> but that's what I'm can. saying. Because we'd, we'd be looked at, at as <laughs> waste men. You think we don't want to? It's <laughs> different for men. I want to be a princess. I want to be a princess. princess. <laughs> <laughs> it, because we'd be... Back in, in society and social media, which goes on in hand, we'll be looked at suckers. But in society and social media, but what about, like, what about your manhood? Like, oh, what do you, your and now they throw our man with well, no, 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 no. I, I have as a, a I have man. A, no, as, I, no, I have a genuine, what? genuine, genuine question. Like, as a man, you won't feel a way. Like, if your woman's like if providing I, for you, I would not feel a way because she's yes. treating me. Providing for me, yes. Pro that's a different. Treating me is different, but providing for me, no, yeah, yeah. Okay, me. you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You can't. No, uh, my, my woman can't. Can't. <laughs> If a if a woman is yeah, treating me due to my hard work. <laughs> nah, I can't provide for me. All right, let me ask, let me ask y'all this though. Good look, good palm me. We have it. No, for, for. We're rich. We're rich. Okay. We're rich. Would you rather be in love with your? Sorry. Would you rather be with the love of your life and check and be checked? Sorry, let me ask you over. All right, so it's time for some random would you rather's. All right, ready? Are there gonna be some film questions in there? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Would you rather be with the love of your life and be check to check? Or be wealthy and with someone who is only who you're only there with for the money. Uh, the first one still. The first one. You rather be check to check. Check to check. Yeah. check you rather be check to check? Check to check still. Really? 
You're a real one for that one. How many zeros? Six. Six zeros. You're asking for a friend? Six zeros. Why? Because most people are living check to check anyways in this day and age. And check to check doesn't necessarily mean you're broke. You can have a big check. And still be living check to check. Facts. You're saying the rent could be a hundred thousand. You could still be check to check and have a big check. Facts. You know. Well, That's why I said check to check too. Uh, yeah. If. Yeah, I don't know. Boy. And mans are moving like mans can't see if. Right. Like when you live check but to check, you're not know, see if things. That's the whole point. It's not check to check now. Yeah, it can't be. I say, I say, uh, give me the money. Anyways, hmm? you must say, give me the money. Uh, give me the money. Yeah. Show yeah. me the money. <laughs> Show me the money. <laughs> Show me the money. All right. Would you rather get ten dollars for every step you take, or ten cents for every time you blink? Blink. Ten dollars every step I take, because we all the the amount of the amount of jobs I've worked, fams, and the amount of walking I've done. Like one day, I made like twenty k steps. So you take steps or blinking? Blink. I'm taking steps. Because you said ten dollars every step. Yeah. At some point, you can stop. You can literally like. I'll blink. take the steps because the it step, would encourage man. me to walk more. Facts. Exercise. 20K steps. Let me do the math. I can do 10 blinks in a 10. In, Times in a, 10. Not even a that's, minute. That's, that's 200. Like, yeah. That's 200K, fam. So, yeah, I'm good. And now that you know you're I'm making good. money, people are just going to be just... T- <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're going to get twitches. You regardless. And now you know you're making money off the blinks? So just... But it's 10 cents. Yeah, it's up. Ten how, times. how many times do you blink in a minute? That's what I'm saying. How many times do you walk? Okay, let me see. People don't walk. People use bus. People bike. But that's people, what I'm saying. People work. It will, it will encourage work. you to walk more. Like I said, for me, the jobs I work, I'm doing a lot of walking. You know what I'm saying? I, think about it. I work at a Rogers Center. I work with kids. I work at retail. I work at a restaurant. And I run my own the Average place. Average human blinks 12 times per minute. That's a dollar. Dollar 20. No? And I'm $1. stepping. 20, and I times that by 60. And once again, this is natural. So me now, I'm just going to be just, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just, You're going to just... Uh, 70, $72 dollars an hour. That's not a bad check. So you're, you're up you're up for like, what, 16 hours a day? Want to wanna call it that? That's our $1,152. A day. A day. Just from blinking. Once again, natural blinking. But what if you do over That's 10K? 30, what if you do over 10K steps? I've done 20K steps in like two days. In a days. day. And so that's how much well, I would get. But you can't maintain that, sir. What? You can't maintain. I can't. Oh, walk. I don't even have my watch on me. I would have showed you how many steps I had. All Before right, I um, came here, I was already at 10k steps. Thank you. That was 100k. All right. So movie, movie. All right. Who's a better actor, Crystal? You, you're the, you're the actress here. Um, let me see. Viola Davis or Angela Bassett? Angela Bassett. Why Angela Bassett? I think they're both brilliant actors, but I just feel like um, Angela Bassett brings kind of more of like a a depth and a rawness to her roles. I don't know. I feel like she has a little bit more vers- versatility. versatility. I don't know, but they're both amazing. Like it's that's a very hard one. Okay, Damson Indris or Michael B. Jordan. Who would you rather see play an action hero? See play action, action hero, hero Michael, Michael B. Michael Jordan. Because he's done it already. He was Killmonger. That's his biggest role. That's his biggest role, Killmonger. I mean, but Damson might get um Kang. No. You don't think he could do Kang? No. Kang the Conqueror. No. His, his friend, uh, no. Jonathan Majors. Oh, he Jonathan got fired from no. being a woman. There's there's other actors that are, that can do Kang. Before that, I put before Damson. Who would you who would you like to see play Kang? I want I want to, I don't want them to switch actors. You uh, we have to. Even though <laughs> I want Jonathan Majors. Even after he. He hasn't Beat been convicted. He hasn't. <laughs> he hasn't been convicted. He, he hasn't been convicted. We don't know. It's not looking good, though. It's not looking good. He hasn't good, been convicted bruv. yet. It's not looking good. So we don't know. So I want him. If not, then there's there's maybe like Yaya Mateen. Who? Yaya? Give us give as us King. King. Yaya Mateen. Who's Yaya? Where was he? Uh, he played um Candyman. 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 Okay. Um, okay. Okay. I, you, I love that I'm ambulance. I know people don't like ambulance, but I love ambulance. What's ambulance? With, with um, Yaya and um, Jake Gyllenhaal. I don't think oh. Michael Bay. 
Oh, I don't think I watched that. You watch that? Mm-mm. I heard about it, though. I heard think about Bad it. Boys, but stuck in the ambulance driving around. I heard around. about it. I think Yaya could probably... He has the look for Kang. I mean, he played another blue guy before. You watched The Watchmen? Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was... Mm-hmm. He was, um... Yeah. So... Yeah. More, and even Morpheus, right? I didn't, wa- I didn't finish watching it yet. I watched 10 minutes of it. It, it started off weird. It's like... It's, like, it's a crypto... They start, I'm like, yo, why is Neo a crypto guy? Or some shit. Neo? Yeah. He was like a... Yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a whole thing. Watch the show. Oh, you didn't watch Matrix 4? No. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yaya is in there, too. Um, let me see. Uh, John Boyega. Am I saying their name right? Yeah. Or Daniel Kaluga. Kaluya? Kaluya. <laughs> Kaluga. Kalukia. <laughs> My apologies. Um, that one's Kaluya. hard. Who's a better actor? John Boyega or Daniel Kaluga? That one's definitely hard. They're both really good. <sighs> I can't. I personally like Daniel Kaluuya. Um, oh, oh, he's a he's a drunk now. Daniel Kaluuya, <laughs> Kaluuya, yeah. But I don't know. They're really good. That's that's a hard one. I can't pick. In terms of better, more skilled, I can't. Daniel, he was in Get Out, right? He was yeah. Out? Yeah, Get Out. I don't know. John was good in um, Woman King. He was getting women king, yeah. Yeah, Flynn. Flynn wasn't too bad either. Mm-hmm. Flynn, Flynn. You, I think he could do Kang, but he wouldn't. He wouldn't do another franchise though. Think about it. He he might need to hit the gym, but he could do it. He could do Kang. He wouldn't do one of those. Guys. He could do Kang. He would be a perfect king. Mm, Jonathan Majors is a perfect king. That's until he beat the white woman. We don't, know, we don't know We don't know if he had <laughs> Okay Nothing has been proven yet Okay What's what's one good good movie that you saw That you would recommend for people Okay I just saw a movie yesterday So I'll just say this one um, Chevalier Chevalier It's about the The Black Essentially like the black boats, Mozart The black Oh Oh yeah yeah it's um Is that based on a true story or it is? It's based really? on a true story, yeah. Oh. It's really good. And I'm surprised it doesn't have the hype the way it does. But it's really, really good. It's in theaters right now. You guys should go watch it. Okay. Very good. All right. What's a series you're watching? From That's the name of the series? Yeah. Oh. It's called From. And Netflix, where what who was about? I think it's on Paramount Plus. So it's basically about uh, like people that travel to a town. They get stuck in a town, and they can't find their way out. They don't know. Oh, like, yeah, I'm sold. They don't know how they got there, and there's sold. these monsters that come out at sold. night. Sold. Um, but the monsters, um, they take on the sh- the form of like human beings. Sold. And so they essentially like the only way that the monsters can like come and like nam you up or eat you out. <laughs> that's not right. Oh, yo. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. What? You know what? That two to one. I mean, like, can, like, like, eat you is yeah. if you let them in. Uh, and so they, like, they try to entice the humans. They, like, because they take on the form of, like, this on Paramount? really, yeah, Paramount Plus. They take on the form of, like, really nice human beings. And they like stand at the doorway or the window and they like smile at you and they like they try to like taunt they try to like entice you to let you, to let you in and if you let it's just a really good show like it's actually a, I watched the whole season one in like one sitting it's a very good show I'm gonna check it out what's what's, from? what's the what's the top five if you can top five TV series of the last two years God that's too hard the last two years though not not like all time. <sighs> From COVID till now, I guess. That's hard. Um, okay, Squid Game. Mm. Okay. Alice in Borderland. I'm not familiar with that one. Uh, I might have to put From in there. From is really good. From is that good, eh? Um, oh, God. I'm drawing a blank. Umbrella Academy, possibly. I've watched so Stranger. many shows. Stranger, Stranger Things. I would have said if I watched uh, Snowfall, I guess. I haven't watched Snowfall. 
the suits. I'm a I'm a thriller girl. I like thrillers and like sci-fi shows. That's my, that's like my go-to stuff. Okay, so why is Gone Baby the greatest psychological thriller? Of Gone all time? Baby, I never watched it. You never watched Gone Baby? Mm mm. Ben Affleck? Mm mm. You're lying. I never watched it. You like thrillers and you never seen Gone Baby? Cause I don't like horror. It's not horror. I never watched it. What's what's the what's a good thriller that you like? Oh, I was gonna say. Uh, uh, Jeffrey Dahmer. I oh, watched it, but I found I it disturbing. Yeah, I, didn't really, I, watch, I didn't really enjoy it. I didn't watch it because it's real. Yeah, it was it was a bit too disturbing. Yeah, because it's real. Like I seen the clip where the the sister was cussing out, um, in the courthouse, and I seen the the real clip. Yo, it's airy, bro. Yeah, yeah. It looks too real. Oh, God, that's yeah. hard. Yeah. That's hard. Sorry. Sorry. All right, no worries. All right, give the people them your your link, your shout outs. Where, where Guys, to thanks you. for inviting me. Finally, I've never been able to make it, but thanks for inviting me, guys. Come on. Um, you can follow me on crystal.c.rose on Instagram. I that's that's the only social media platform I really care about. But from there, I have links to all my other stuff. Like, you know, if you want to check out my show. I was going to say, what's the next show we're going to see you on now? Or can you indulge? Can you? I make a, a, simple, I make a small appearance on The Boys. No way. Next season. It's lit. Okay. You're lying. No way. Yeah, small Please don't appearance. tell me you die. Please don't be honest. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, thank no, no, God. We spent no, no. all this time small. talking about women and men when I could <laughs> move going on the into boys. The Boys. What? It's a very small appearance, but, you know. And um, you don't die? We're Stop trying to ruin my whatever I'm I'm happy. No, Usually I don't. It's, you Wait, know. you're on the new season? Yeah, season five. I don't think it's out yet. Yeah. Okay, okay. Let's go. So. Nerd. Yeah, that's. And then I'm um, also doing like my own stuff. Um, I'm I'm producing a film right now. So. Called Men with Podcast. I've been working. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Listen, it's I don't I don't get I don't get that concept, but you have I'm to explain you. the concept better. Like you have to pitch it better. Um, I don't know pitch me in, bro. You gotta pitch it better. I don't know pitch me. But yeah, um, and then yeah, my I have another film that's out right now that's doing the um, festival runs, um, which has been good so far. But yeah, just follow me on social media. You'll see all what I'm up to. All right, perfect. You guys already know. Probably up there, my care. Down there, my care. On the <laughs> left side, my care. Maybe on the right side, my care. And the two corners, my care. But you see, we... You know, man. Don't you know, man, don't care. Aw. Oh. Oh.